electric RC aircraft guy, otherwise known as Gabriel. I'd like to show you my capacitive touch sensor that I've been working on. So here it is. This is a, uh, a basic Arduino with a couple LEDs. The goal here is to make this a touch lamp. So let's zoom in. So here I've got just a basic touch lamp. Eventually I'm going to go ahead and hook it up to a relay and use an actual lamp, a 120 volt lamp. I'll have to be more careful though, make sure I do the electronics properly, use the right circuits and protect everything so that I don't have a risk of electric shock. So here we go, this is just a regular wire hooked up, hooked up to the Arduino through pin 7 and then I've got an LED connected to it over here. I could use the onboard LED 13 in the Arduino but I chose to use a, a separate one just because it's brighter. So there it is. Touch lamp using capacitive touch and I'm debouncing the uh, capacitive touch reading on both contact and uncontact. In other words, as I touch it, I'm debouncing it and as I'm releasing from it, I'm debouncing it to ensure that I don't get any jitter. It took me quite a bit of time. It's been something that I've been working on for a while, but I finally have the skills to do it. Here's the lamp that I'm going to be using. Just a basic 120 volt desk lamp. It's got a nice metal base. I'll just uh, tape on the the wire here to uh, be able to detect my touch anywhere on the metal part of the lamp. And then instead of running the output to an LED like I'm doing here, I'll run it to a resistor set up properly with a transistor, snubber diode, etc in order to uh, turn the lamp on and off through the wall. So that's it. Be sure to check out my blog. Uh, you can find a direct link to it at ercaguy.blogspot.com and uh, go ahead and subscribe to my blog. There's a link on the right of the blog and also to my videos if you like, but uh, the blog has better information.